everyone, welcome back to the channel. My name is Rochelle from Rochelle Handmade Designs and in this video, I am giving you 12 patterns that you can sew up this summer to beat the summer heat. Now, here in Orlando, Florida, it is like 90 degrees almost every single day or it feels like 100 degrees outside, okay? So I decided to show you guys 12 patterns that you can sew up that's pretty easy to sew. I tried to pick patterns that are easy to sew that you can sew up to beat the summer heat, all right? So before we get started, go ahead and hit the like button, the subscribe button, and also turn on the notification bell so you are notified every time I upload a new video. So without further ado, let's do 12 patterns in 12 minutes, all right? Starting with the first pattern, we're gonna talk about tops first. So the first one, and I have my notes here, the first one is a bralette. So for the bralette, I have done a bralette on my channel for so along and it's Simplic Simplicity 8549 for that pattern, which I'll go ahead and put the so along, the link to the so along in the description box below and also put it on the end screen. But the reason why I chose that is because, come on, woo, who don't want a bralette or a crop top for the summertime. Now, me personally, I did sew the bralette. I have wore it like two or three times since making it, um, but I have small children, so I don't get to wear it as much as I would like, but a bralette is one thing that you would want to have in your wardrobe. So, if you cannot find Simplicity 8549, another good pattern is Simplicity 1325, I believe, which I will also put all of these patterns up on the screen so you are able to see it. But you need a bralette in your wardrobe for the summertime. The second pattern or second item would be a tank top. So the pattern that I'm going to suggest is Simplicity 1366, which I have done a sew along for that as well on the channel, which I will go ahead and put the link in the description box below as well and put it on the end screen so you can see that video as well. If you cannot find Simplicity 1366, you can use Simplicity 9114, which is a Mimi G pattern, or the Ogden Cami. So those are, you know, other options that you can use in order to get a tank top in your wardrobe, all right? So moving on from the tops to the dresses, the first dress is a strappy dress. So you want something where the back out to where, you know, you got the nice sun hitting your back and it's flowy. The pattern that I'm gonna suggest to you is Simplicity 8635. So many sewers have done this pattern. You need a strappy dress or a backless dress in your um, wardrobe for the summertime. Next one, a sundress. So I have two patterns to recommend to you. The first one is McCall's 8213, which I know, I think Creativity by T. Talisha did this pattern in a watermelon print, I believe, which um, I'll try to link it below to her channel. I'll put it in the description box below or I'll actually just put a picture of it up on the screen so you could see um, what her watermelon dress looked like for her um, sundress. Also, you can use Mimi G patterns, uh, the Jessica PDF pattern. I know some of you are not big fans of PDF patterns, but I think it's a good pattern to recommend for a sundress, all right? Next pattern. A cami dress. So you need a cami dress and I'm gonna recommend a few patterns. So the first one is Mimi G's The Reese's PDF pattern that you could download for like $5, I believe. Um, or if you can't find that, you can use Simplic Simplicity 8545. You can also use Simplicity 9114 and extend the top and make it a dress. Or you could use the pattern that I recommend before that I have a tutorial for, Sim Plicity 1366 for a cami dress. It's just basically strapped front, back, you're done. Like three or four pieces and you're good to go to sew that dress, all right? Next one, baby doll dress. So the pattern that I'm recommending is McCall's 8197. I have done this pattern. I like the pattern as well. So yes, that is a pattern that you want to do. You want a baby doll dress, you just throw it on, go to the grocery store, dress it up with heels, dress it down with sneakers, and you good to go. 
a baby doll dress is what you need. Next one, a peasant style dress. And the pattern that I'm gonna recommend, um, Brittany J. Jones did this pattern, McCall's 8092. If you cannot find that pattern, there is a Butterick pattern, Butterick 6757. Both of those are great patterns that you can do a peasant style dress. Next one, a knit t-shirt style dress. Basically a regular crew neck style shirt or any type of knit style t-shirt dress you just throw on with some tennis shoes and you're good to go. Pattern that I'm gonna recommend is New Look 6458. Also, you can go to Mimi G's channel where she show you how to sew up a dress using a t-shirt. So you can do that as well. Next thing that you need, a romper. So there are so many romper patterns. I know I just did McCall 7115 for a romper, um, but one pattern that I am going to suggest that I want to do is McCall's 8119. I wanna do that romper pattern. Another one that I want to do, Talisha have done this pattern, it's McCall's 8069. Four pattern pieces and you're good to go. So you can do that. And another one I will recommend to you, which has a sew along to it, Mimi G did it and it is Simplicity 9125. The old pattern is Simplicity 1355. So that is a couple of romper patterns that you can use. All right, so now moving over from the romper to things that you would do as a layering piece. So number one, you need a beach cover up or a caftan. So, a good pattern, Simplicity 9102. I have done this pattern um, many, I would say many moons ago. I have done it, I never posted uh, the make. I don't even know where it's at to be honest with you, but it turned out really good. Another one, Talisha actually just made this pattern um, for her bonus make for the hashtag sewing five and below. It's Simplicity 5628. Eight. So you need a caftan or a cover up. So make sure you write that down. Put a pattern that you know that you want to do in your wardrobe. All right. Next one, a circle skirt. So you can do a circle skirt so many ways. You could go to Moods Fabric um, and draft one yourself, or you could use the pattern Sim Simplicity 9123 in order to create a circle skirt. And the last thing that you need as part of this beat the summer heat patterns is a swimsuit. And the swimsuit I'm going to recommend, there is a sew along for it, McCall's 5400. Mimi G did a sew along for it as well. Well, that's all that I have for you in this video. These are 12 patterns that you can sew up to beat the summer heat. Tell me what you think about my list of the 12 patterns that I gave to you and the style of the garment that you can create. So don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Turn on the notification bell so you are notified every time I upload a new video. Also, stay tuned for Sunday when I collaborate with another Instagrammer and YouTuber on hashtag so much color. So I'll see you in the next video. And as always, keep sewing.